There are two basic types of pharmaceutical treatments for psoriasis. Topical, applied to skin, and body-wide, taken internally. Available both over-the-counter and by prescription, these products can be used separately or in combination with each other to reduce psoriasis symptoms, and they can be used to keep flare-ups under control. To maximize the effectiveness of these medications and to avoid possible interactions or side effects, it is always advisable to develop an overall treatment plan and discuss all of the options with your doctor. Also, be prepared to try different products and combinations if a medication begins to lose its effectiveness over time. Individuals with psoriasis may experience some severe physical discomfort and disability. Itching and pain can interfere with basic functions, such as self-care, walking, and sleep. Plagues on hands and feet prevent individuals from working at certain occupations, playing some sports, and caring for family members. The frequency of medical care is costly and can interfere with an employment or school schedule. People with moderate to severe psoriasis may feel self-conscious about their appearance and have a poor self-image that stems from the fear of public rejection and psychosexual concerns. Psychological distress can lead to significant depression and social isolation. Getting rid of psoriasis involves much more than just applying some lotion or taking a pill. That's why doctors say there's no cure, meaning that they're unable to recommend a cream or a pill to cure the problem. But that doesn't mean there isn't a cure. Countless people have gotten rid of their psoriasis over the years by following the three proven steps required to address any psoriasis problem. Are you taking the required steps? Visit the 3 stepcurecom and follow the proven steps of others who have successfully dealt with their psoriasis.